Welcome, hello and welcome back to SCP Containment Breach. This is part 7, I think. And we're continuing left off of being chased by a blob that says Jerry and getting away from SCP-173 as usual. So we're continuing from there. And also to uh, continue after what I said in part 6 or whatever my last episode, I found it when I hit the escape menu, all the, the letters would be gone, it would be crashable. For some reason, DX Tori is actually what's affecting it. Because as soon as I stopped the recording, the the words came back. I have no idea why, but oh well. We're opening this. I'm blinking because I know SCP-173 loves coming the fuck up here. That's at least how much I know from Markiplier's playthroughs when I used to watch them. Every time, it would seem like SCP-173 would just show up randomly here. So I'm going to be very cautious and do what I can here. My only problem is... Oh, you're fucking with me. Do I... That's, that's the thing, actually, I don't understand. I might have to look up is... I don't want to turn my back to... Is... Remote... Oh, remote door control. Well, I want that off, obviously. Is... Do I need to turn off the lighting to... For a mission? Like, I... The remote door control is obvious that I need to flick that. Let's check this out. Uh, new modular, doo -doo 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 -doo, blah blah blah, literally blah blah. Gotta kill F Franklin. I I don't know if the primary lighting. There's like multiple objectives. I assume I'd have to look it up, but I may just leave it for later. Like the remote door control, I I want off obviously, but the primary lighting and secondary lighting. I'm assuming this is to release an SCP or um. It's for, like, the, the robot. Like, I know... Hmm. Well, what's this? Let's see if I can read this and it'll help me. We replaced the worn-out cables at the elevator this morning. That's useless. I, I, I don't know. It's... Just... I'm gonna... Fuck it. I'm gonna look it up just so I know I'm not fucking up. And I can make a choice here, so be right back. Alright, well, I have no idea. The wiki doesn't really state what each of them primarily does. Just primary lighting is an obvious where it turns off lighting. Secondary... I guess specific rooms and remote door control apparently makes it so the SCP robot or AI program cannot shut the door in my face. Which has only happened once really, so not too big of a deal. But we turned it off and apparently we'll activate a quest, if you will, or an objective where another SCP will make a deal with me. So we're going to have to find out who that is and where and go from there. No, keycard. Yeah, whatever. I'm sweating balls, by the way. My room is getting really, really fucking hot. Actually, I think that I think I remember these rooms from. Uh, I think I remember these rooms. I think this is where I talked to the SCP, anyways. Hello, hello. I'll just take this through the window. That. Ugh. No problem. No biggie here. Uh, SCP-860 is used to unlock and open a door. The door does not lead to its usual destination. Instead, it opens into a small forest clearing covered... Oh. Oh, okay. I can use the key here, then. Let's do it. Well, first, I'm gonna... Hmm, won't budge. Omnicard. No. Okay, well... Let's do it! Nice! A new place to explore. I, I basically know what's here. It's that weird cat thing. But I don't... Hello! Aren't you a cutie? Hopefully, we can uh, get to the the end without complications. I, I, I don't know... Let's see if I can... Something seems to have gone wrong the moment I entered the forest. Communication with the researchers was lost. My headset is playing soft music instead. It's very calming. The blue hue is beautiful, and I've never felt more... Okay, well, let's turn on the radio. Let's hope this helps calm the kitty SCP. Now, let's go to the right. Hopefully, the music calms the SCP as well, and it loves this great elevator music. It's probably behind me, though. I'm, I'm not looking back. I'm just... I'm just gonna mind my own fucking business, walking in its domain, hoping it doesn't fucking mind as I play beautiful music. Pretty 
pre-recorded messages. Okay. Funny. But yeah, I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Wait. What? What is he doing here? Why is he invading this area? Isn't Blue Kitty person gonna be like... Wait, what square? Oh. Well, fuck him. I'm playing wonderful music to... Oh, continue blocking him, please. Old man's gonna block the kitty monster from killing me. I think I should start running a tiny bit, though. And we're going this way. Let's see what the, the soldiers are up to. Well, the soldiers just don't have any community. Huh. Well, apparently the old man's just blocking the kitty and uh, not causing me any trouble. Whatever. Fuck that. That's noisy as fuck. Oh, this, this game is stressful, though. My room is getting so heated up. I hear it behind me, I think. I'm going this way. I don't know if there's an end destination where it leads me out and... Uh... Hmm. I, I just don't know, really. I'm. Oh, here's a door, whatever. It feels like it's where I came from, but... Whatever, let's leave. Or not. Hi! No! Oh. The infinite... Infinite? What? Infinite loop. And it crashed. Great. Great. Great time, always crashing. Always fucking crashing. It's, it's one of the things that makes it so I don't want to play this game. I so get tired of the crashing. But... I'll be right back. Alright, we are back, and we're not going to go back in that fucking room. Unless there is something that I'm missing. It's just... Ah, I don't know the access codes. Maybe it's because I don't read the letters, but... I, I just... I don't, I don't know the code. Ah, well, that's probably gonna... What What was that noise even? Anyways, whatever. We're, we're going back and exploring new rooms if possible. Hopefully not dying. Hopefully not. Uh, I don't think I came this way. So we're going this way. Alright. What's over here? I don't think I've been this way. No bear. No soldiers. The doors are open, so it makes me feel like I've been here. I wonder if this is actually where I was in part two. Oh, no! No! Fuck! I'm dead. There's no way to avoid that guy. I don't think. Why was he there? Is that just where his room is? I'm gonna have to check, because... Ah, eh, fuck, I'm gonna check. He's gonna come bursting at, out at me anyway, so... Hello! Uh... Oh god! Good timing, I closed it right when he was in the, the fucking doorway. Okay! Don't crash, please. Alright, so apparently I've gone back, or... Went around in a circle enough that I I, I just re-reached that thing. So I'm not gonna go that way, I'm going to go this way. Yeah. Cause I, I, I gotta stay in these office rooms and f hmm. And just find whatever that SCP was. I think it was an SCP that wears a mask. I think. I don't like this fucking area. 
This also would be where SCP-173 loves to patrol because there's a lot of corners. <gasps> a ducky! I found a duck. Please don't tell me it's an evil duck. He floats. And he stares at me. A little creepy, but it is a rubber ducky and it goes whack. Hmm, batteries. Stairs. Huh, well, what's over here? New area! And it's a dead fucking end. Great. Alright. We're back in the room where the nine tailed unit was, but also where the SCP 173 was. They seem to close all the doors, too. Huh? Really? Again? How many times must they fucking zap you? Hmm. Anyways, we're, we're, we're gonna zap this little shit. Alright. Yeah, come in here. Come into the light. Zap. How many times have I killed them? It's just been so much now. And we're continuing from there. Dr. Maynard, I do not know the code. Dr. Gears, I, I do not also know the code. I know nothing of these codes. Hmm. Heavy containment zone. Blink, boop. Ah. Every time I walk in a room like this, I just have the worst feeling because of that one jump scare I had in part 3 where SCP-173 just came out of nowhere in that room. So every time I see it, I just get bad memories. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, it's a, it's a familiar area, but unless I leave the doors open, I don't think... Oh. Oh. This area. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. This is definitely a familiar area, though. I just don't know if there's anything I have to go back to or not. So I'm gonna just continue exploring before running back there. As you, fuck it. I'm, I'm just gonna explore this way. If nothing interesting happens, it, it doesn't matter to you guys anyways, because I won't be recording it. But I'm going to go back, knowing that I turned off the power to some things. I should be able to get back to the warhead if this was the same game. Hmm. But yeah, if it's the uh, if it's the same game, then uh, then technically I should be able to do the warheads and get that objective done if I've already done the prerequisites. This room also inspires great. Ow. Oh. In the, in the dead end. Okay. This room always inspires the best memories of me dying. I have no idea where I'm going, really. I I don't have the map with me, and that's one thing I think I was criticized on because I dropped the map. I mean, even then, the the layout of the map is very, very small. Very small. God, God damn you. So, wait, back here? Wow. Okay, I, I'm lost. Um, yeah, I'm just going to be wandering for a bit, I guess. What? Why? Oh, the walls. Let's get the fuck out of here. Or what's happening? Maybe you should walk through them. No. Apparently not. All right, well, they just... Maybe I haven't been here. Now, this is different. What is this? Oh. I remember using that face for a thumbnail. What is this? Is this screamy, screamy, mick, anger, don't look at me guy? Huh. This is different. Different is good. Because it means I haven't been here yet. Right, close that. Oh, I, I need these. I... Oh, 
Great, yeah, I, I need batteries. So, uh-oh. The thing that killed me before and slashed my anus until I bled uh, was the thing that needs this night vision goggles. So, if I find batteries, then... Shit, I think it's in this room. I just gotta make sure not to bump into him or else he'll start scratching my ass over and over again. He's gonna be somewhere in this room, but... Oh! Fuck you, nine-tailed fucking unit. That's... I hate them the most, though. They're sort of like giant... Ah, and the game crashed again. They're, they're kind of like giant cock blocks. It's just you don't want to run into them. They're paying the fucking ass. I don't know. With that, though, I, I think I've, I've done enough also for this episode. I, it feels like I haven't really even played 20 minutes worth of this game, but apparently I already have. Also, there's a light beaming on my nose again. It's it's 5 p.m. in the sun when it has the sunset loves to be on my face so i'm going to take a break here and the episode and wait till the sun stops beaming on my face because i'm not rudolph i'm not so i hope you enjoyed as if you can even reach if you did please leave a like comment hit that subscribe button become a subscriber until the next time sullivan james fell down flat i do sullivan not sullivan james is withered and blue I'm going to go backwards now. Sullivan James is coming for you.